video, I'm going to walk through how to create a landing page in Travify's website builder, and we'll show you an example of how to create one along the way. So first, where to access this is you can click on your name in the top right hand corner, and then click website. And this will bring you into the website builder. Then when you're ready to create a brand new landing page, you can click right up here, and then you can click create new page. Now, what the landing page is designed to do is it's a way to create standalone marketing outside of your website. So an example might include creating a landing page for a group trip or a destination wedding or a promotion, just to name a few ideas. You can create as many landing pages as you would like in here as well. Now, I've already began creating one, this Gems of Southeast Europe. In this example, this is where I wanted to create a river cruise, a group cruise that I am trying to get people to sign up for. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to walk through all of the elements in here and we're going to add a couple here together. So first, when you create a new landing page, you'll be able to select the theme in here so you can always switch the theme. So if you want to use a different theme, you can. And then you can also set your theme color here as well. You can also go ahead and put that page slug, which is going to be at the end of that URL. So you can see my URL name here, and then there's 2022-river-cruise, and you can put any page slug you want in there. You'll also find the SEO and social in here. So this is important to fill out, so that way someone can help find your landing page if they're searching for something in particular. So now to go through these elements, you've probably watched the video with the website builder where we walk through each of the elements. So in this, a great way to set up a landing page is to first start with a hero. So you can add the hero element by clicking new element and then choose hero and then just simply drag and drop it right in. So I have this one already added and you can see I put a heading, a subheading, and I also included an image here. The next, next thing that's great to add is just to have a compelling message. You know, again, give them something that pulls their attention in and isn't too much text heavy, but it's, it's just great to view and gives them something to want more. So in this one, I used an aside. And this is, again, another element in here that you can see there's left and there's right asides that you can use. And I just used this one right here. And I added a description, a heading, and then also included that image. I also added a testimonial below because this is good social proof. So you can see that this looks similar to the first one right above. And this is also an aside. And this is just a left one so that the photo appears on the left. The next element that I want to add, I want to add with you. So in this element, we want to add a trip. So the great thing about working with Travify and this also being a landing page builder is that if you create a trip in your Travify account, you can then bring that in and import it into your website as well. So how you want to do that is first, we're going to go ahead and click new element. The element that we want to use in this particular instance is the trip gallery. So you'll find the trip gallery in here and I'm just going to go ahead and drag and drop it right in. And here it is. So you can see that it's brought in. Now I can, of course, give it a heading and a description if I want. Um, but you'll also see that there's three cards in here. And I'm actually just going to delete two of these because I just want to showcase one trip. So to pull in the trip from Travify, I'm just going to click this pencil icon. And then down here, I'm going to go ahead and click import from Travify. Then I'm going to select trip. And now it's going to display all of the trips that I have available in my account. Now, the Gems of Southeast Europe, that is the one that I want. So I'm going to go ahead and click that one and add it. Now you'll see that it is going to go ahead and automatically display the photo that I have for this trip. And then I can add more information. So I'm going to add this badge area. I'm going to utilize it. This badge is a great place if you want to call something out. So in this case, I'm going to use the trip dates, but you could use the space for pricing or you could say limited spaces available or now booking, anything that you want to include that maybe just calls it out. I'm also going to go ahead and I'm going to put a little blurb down below about this trip, just into the description area here. And that's all I'm going to do. And then I'm just going to hit save. 
And now this trip is all ready to go in here. And now what's great about this is when they click on this trip, so if we click preview, we're gonna go down to this trip and we click view trip, it automatically opens up into my Travify itinerary that I created and then it just gives them the option to contact me directly from here as well. The next element that I wanna add together is I wanna also include a form. So at the bottom of this page, we wanna add a call to action. Now this call to action is another element. And again, just click the new element button and the call to action and you can drag and drop it in. You can see here that I have already added my button in here and I put my heading and subheading, but I wanna delete that because I wanna add a button with you to show you how this works. So what I'm gonna do is just press add button. And then from here, I wanna add one of the forms that I've created in Travify. So I'm gonna click the form button and then I can put the text of the button. So I wanna say reserve now. And then I can create a new form directly in here if I wanted, or I can import one that I've already created. So this one right here, I've already created. So I'm gonna go ahead and select it and now that form is automatically imported in here. So when I go to preview it, you can see what this will look like. See how it automatically brings my form in here. So that's how you can build a simple landing page. And I know this was really quick and simple, but if you need more help or have any questions, please definitely reach out to our team, either in your account in the live chat or send us an email at professional at travify.com.